Alright guys, how's it going? So I thought I would show you how to simplify a curve in the graph editor. Very simple and basic thing to do to be honest. Now I'm going to quickly jump into my camera view, let me move my timeline up a little bit. And yesterday I made a tutorial showing you how to use the walk navigation. So I'll just use the same method, I'll hit record, I'll hit play. I'll jump into my walk navigation and you can see the keyframes being created here. Now that's quite a lot of keyframes to be honest. So when I play it back, it's a little bit sharp, it's a little bit jaggy, it's maybe too fast in places. So I'm going to simplify the keyframes. Now if you press Shift and F6, that'll bring up the graph editor. But generally I advise you create a new tab, you call it the graph editor, and you quickly do something like this. Now in order to use the simplify curve, you need to come to edit, go to preferences, quickly jump into add-ons, and search for simplify. And you can see here, Simplify Curves Plus. Now what you need to do is select all the keyframes, press F3 to bring up your search, and search for Simplify. And you'll see that it brings a dialog box on the left hand side. And we have a distance error. You can see that I have quite a lot of keyframes here. It's pretty janky and it's pretty, it's pretty damn heavy to be honest. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the distance error up ever so slightly. And you can see it start to reduce the curve. And it just kind of simplifies the curve. Now, if you're being 100% with your animation, this might not be the best method, but it does generally reduce the keyframes. So this time when I jump into layout and I play it back, I should, in theory, get the same motion, but it should be a little bit smoother with less keyframes. And that's pretty much how you simplify a curve in Blender. Do me a favour, guys. Like the video. Subscribe to the channel. It costs you absolutely nothing. Follow me on Twitter. You know what to do. Peace.